With general elections around the corner in Pakistan administered Kashmir, nationalist leaders have little hope. As they say, successive governments have never ever worked for the welfare of the people of the region and expect no wonders. Pakistan administered Kashmir is all set for elections this June as more than 3 million people are expected to vote to elect 41 lawmakers of the assembly. But not many are enthusiastic. Nationalist leaders say the elections are meaningless as the government of the region doesn't enjoy real power and can't take decisions on its own. president Ibrahim Khan तो उनको भी मतलब 5 साल वो भी पाकिस्तान के खिलाफ लड़ते रहे उनको भी कैद में रखा गया फिर के एच खुर्शीद जो थे लिबरेशन लीग के कायद आजम के पॉलिटिकल सेक्रेटरी रहे तो जब वो इलेक्ट हुए तो उनको भी आर्मी ने गिरफ्तार करके हटा दिया तो अब उसको आजाद आप कैसे कह सकते हैं जब एक मतलब हाईएस्ट अथॉरिटी जो जिसको पब्लिक इलेक्ट करके आती है उसको दो बंदे आके पकड़ के ले जाते हैं और उसको उठा के तो वो कहते हैं जी नया इलेक्शन होगा so, Khan says successive governments in the region have failed to address the concerns of the people and have performed miserably. Many people in the media, the Azad Kashmir ministers, even the Prime Minister, Sardar Skandar, I have heard him say that this is not our section of the section. So, we are going to the media. Pakistan administered Kashmir, which was illegally annexed by Islamabad about seven decades ago, is one of the most underdeveloped provinces and people continue to reel under poverty. Locals claim that Pakistan has been exploiting the region, which has rich mineral resources for its own benefits.